Andre says the holiday season is a period when many individuals become victims of crimes, but most occurrences may be prevented if people pay close attention to their surroundings and take proactive safeguards. He added that the festive season brings an increase in traveling, shopping and socializing. Therefore, it appears to be a peak period where crime rates escalate. The streets and bars of Svakopmund are fully packed and police visibility will be the order of the day during the festive season. So um, I'm happy to be here and to be part of this uh, operation and also to see <laughs> Uh, what are the elements that need to be addressed from us as politicians when we talk about uh, keeping our country safe. So I am therefore also here to observe what are the uh, serious issues in our communities. Of course, we are also going to ensure that we encourage our members of communities to conduct themselves in a, in a better manner and also to, to be informed that the police is just there to help you and not to really fight you, but it's there to keep you safe and also to ensure that uh, there's law and order in our communities and streets. That I will, of course, also address with the other leadership, with the political leadership in the region. Irongo Police Commander Commissioner Nicolas Kupembona said the police, together with other stakeholders, will carry out robust police operations during the festive season. The duties and the responsibility of maintaining law and order is uh, our national duty, as enshrined in the Constitution of the Republic of Namibia. And once again, this evening, as per a call of our Inspector General, we always have to be boots on the ground. And tonight, we are going to demonstrate our together. Yes, ensuring that uh, our inhabitants they are well protected properties are well protected as well as lives are well protected we are going out into the streets we are going to conduct body search and you are going to ensure that uh, our streets are safe for all the inhabitants Kupembona says it will be all hands on deck as officers on the ground will be taking a zero-tolerance approach to criminality.